Karibu tena mtazamaji tukisonga mbele ni kwamba wadau kwenye sekta ya uchukuzi wa ndege wametakiwa kukumbatia teknolojia mpya ya kufuatilia na kuna kile taarifa za safari za ndege nchini kama njia mwafaka ya kuimarisha ukusanyaji na uhifadhi wa taarifa muhimu za uchukuzi wa ndege kauli hizi zimetolewa na baadhi ya waandaaji ama waundaji na wauzaji wa mitambo na vifaa vya kufuatilia kuna kile na kuhifadhi taarifa za ndege wanaosema kwa kukumbatia teknolojia hii mpya sekta hiyo itanufaika zaidi in flight safety monitoring system there are eight data buses in an aircraft with thousands and thousands of um, sensors are stored in we extract all the data they want and we can customize what the customer needs from this data that's going to be flying in the canyon skies that is not available anywhere in the world today this is new technology that is employing artificial intelligence again through a scientific analytical analysis of where facts will be looked at about the performance and the health monitoring of all aircraft systems including cockpit of what's going on with the airplanes in real transfer of data in real time this system will provide the insights in in terms of bringing the aircraft uh, health monitoring and the conditions of the aircraft in real time to the ground and i believe that's the uh, future of uh, the aviation industry wito umetolewa kwa wananchi kuwa makini wanapochagua viongozi watakaowakilisha kwenye nyadhifa za uwakilishiwadi ubunge na usineta badala ya kutilia maanani pekee wadhifa wa ugavana na urais mwana mazingira dr kalua green amesema kuwa viongozi hao wa ngazi za chini wana mamlaka makubwa ya kuhakikisha ugatuzi hivyo sharti wananchi wafanye uamuzi wa busara bila jesi na free chama kizuri ambacho hakina dharau ya mtu yeyote mara nyingi Kenya yetu mara nyingi tunakosa kufahamu ni kitu kipi ambacho kitaweza kutubadilishia maisha maisha katika Kenya yetu hayatabadilishwa kwa kuongea tu Hayata badilishwa kwa sababu ya siasa nyingi tunazozipiga wakati huu. Maisha yatabadilika kwa sababu ya mambo ya kujitolea wewe mwenyewe katika familia yako kuwa kiongozi wa kubadilisha nyumba yako, kubadilisha watoto wako, kufanya bidii wewe mwenyewe ili uweze kubadilisha nchi yako na familia yako. Kila mtu akijitolea mama katika kanisa mtu akijitolea katika biashara yake na mambo yote yawe ni sawa kazi itakuwa ni rahisi sana Na alikuwa mbunge wa Makadara Ruben Ndolo amepongeza kinara wa Waipa Kalonzo Musyoka kwa muzi wake wa kujenga na muungano wa Azimio Ndolo alikuwa akizungumza katika kanisa la St Joseph Jericho Mwemaona former vice president Kalonzo Musyoka amekuja kwa azimio. Na ukikumbuka wakati walisimama safari ile walikuwa watu wawili peke yake na wakapata over 6 million votes. Sasa uhuru ndani. Raila ndani. Kalonzo ndani. Eh? U Gideon ndani. Sujui Martha Karua anakuja kesho ndani. Jamani. Hapo kuna mtu atacheza na hiyo kura. Mimi nawaambia 10 million strong. 10 million strong azimio. Na hakuna shida hapo. Sisi tutaamua Kenya hiyo ikuwe sawa sawa umoja ukuweko watu wafanye kazi watoto wetu wapate makazi 
Tukiachana na siasa tuangazie masuala ya maendeleo ambapo chuo kikuu cha Nairobi kinashirikiana na mashirika mengine ya ustawishaji wa wanawake kuendesha utafiti kuhusu uwezo na fursa za kina mama katika biashara na uwekezaji. Mkuu wa utafiti katika chuo cha utafiti na makuzi ya biashara chuo ni humo Alice Waweru amesema kupitia utafiti ni rahisi kutambua na kubaini fursa zilizopo kwa kina mama kuimarika kibiashara aidha kitu hicho huwasaidia kina mama limbukeni katika biashara kwa kuelekeza katika hatua za msingi kwenye biashara I would want to tell the young women out there uh, you cannot know whether you can do it unless you try it maybe if you can try and join this group and the, this university group and try to go through the training you'll be able to realize the potential in you Technosa, we are partnering with the Women Economic Empowerment Hub here at the University of Nairobi. And our role is to build capacity of entrepreneurs, women entrepreneurs. Uh, we are also uh, charged with the mandate of mobilizing the women entrepreneurs from 17 counties across the country. We build capacity, we develop training materials, we develop networking opportunities for the women and also help the women connect with one another. What we are doing is we are targeting to incubate over 600 women businesses over a period of three years. So we we'll work with these women, we will provide uh, incubation services which include capacity building, training, linking them to markets both nationally and regionally and and also linking them to credit facilities and also preparing them in the areas of investment. It's going to unlock the potential that Kenya has. People have begun to discuss, to say we have a lot of our women. You heard what they said. Our women have always managed markets in the rural areas. Then what is the problem? How can they be linked up with uh, uh, the centers that are advancing value addition? Na vijana wametakiwa kuwa wabunifu zaidi ili wabuni njia za kujiajiri wenyewe badala ya kusubiri serikali kuajiri haya lisemwa na wasimamizi wa shirika la biashara kupitia mitandao iken kwenye hafla hiyo waleta pamoja vijana kutoka kote nchini pamoja ili wapate mafunzo kuhusu biashara za mitandaoni hafla hiyo ilifanyika katika hapo jana have been scammed, many people have lost money in online business, but then again, the best thing you need to do before you enter, or before you start any online business company, do a research. Do a research on how it gets its money, how it pays its people, and all about it, is it registered, then that one can make you invest your money. The government cannot provide employment for everybody in Kenya. What the government needs to do is to provide a favorable environment for foreign investors to come in, invest their money. Don't sit down there and wait for a job to locate you. Wake up, find somewhere you can invest on. Come to Iken, make an effort, make sure you work hard with your hands. Don't wait until the time that you're going to get employed by anyone. The government is doing its job to protect uh, unscrupulous uh, traders, dealers, who would come in and uh, take advantage of the innocent people who are looking out to make a gain of uh, whatever their investment is. So the role of government is good. Naam dakika 26 zime katika baada ya saa kumi ya siri kufikia hapo sina la ziada ila kutamatisha mbiu weekend saa kumi na moja mwalimu Frank atakuja hapa na dao la elimu la fursa mbili mwanzangu Nicholas Ombia wambua kumradhi atakuja na darubini ya Afrika mimi ni Suleiman Yeri ala siri njema